What's good, YouTube? Welcome back to Maniachi TV, man. I know y'all see what we got today, man. It's been a little minute since we did a video like this. Now, look, I'm going to keep it a Kobe with y'all. got to keep it a bean with y'all. It's been real slow on YouTube, especially for us reaction channels, man. Ask anybody. It's been slow, man. So I decided, man, let's, let's pop out with another video like this, man. So without further ado, let's just jump right in. Now, yesterday... I saw this on Instagram yesterday morning when I woke up. Kodak Black and NBA Youngboy on FaceTime. Now, I did not see the full video. It looked like we got the full video right here. So, we're going to see what this one all about, man. This major right here. Look who don't came up late night to fuck with the king. Slow down, yank. Slow down, bitch. That shit for real. <laughs> yes, sir. Ooh, yes, sir. Better believe it. Yo, they ain't gonna do nothing but keep them things glossy and raw. Fam, what that bitch tastes like? You ain't hear them yet? No, I ain't hear them yet. Yeah, you know what it is? All right, A1. Yikes, see that right there? That's a slab of real, though, you just hit, yike. Oh, yeah? Yeah, that's like real, though. Like real now. We ain't fucking old, man. Real, you don't came to the trenches and the bandos to eat good with the lean. You know what? I hate how he just, hold on. I hate how bro just answered the phone like it's, like it's just nothing. Like, I wonder when. It kind of make you wonder, like when when they squashed it, like when was like when did they talk? Cause clearly this wasn't the first time. Yes, he he even let it ring a little bit. He was enjoying, you know, enjoying some uh yeah, you know what I mean. But yeah, bro, just answered it like it was nothing. I'm mean, telling who you are. That way, top say bring us some uh, co co coconut rice with the jerk chicken. Coconut rice with the jerk chicken? Yeah. She is telling I make all that. What's up, nigga? NBA young boy, what they do, bitch? What's up, What's up nigga? Hey, 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 look, hey NBA. How you, how you, how you want? You want it? Well, how you want that shit, nigga? <laughs> Y'all boy eating good. Hey, look, when you get a chance, you got to taste this shit here, though. This is what I created. It got a little gumbo style, you, you, but it's you style. You know they having all that shit, Louisiana, all that gumbo. I know. When I used to go to the Bayou Classic, that nigga, they used to have that shit. Okay, but it, yeah. won, it won that Lido. It won that Lauderdale. Yeah, that Wajiri. That Wajiri. That Wajiri. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, boo, yo. Yeah, man, y'all boy. That shit. Yeah, he be, he be putting over right sometimes. Yeah, I get that bitch over rise, too. Boy, you got two of your favorite rappers on his phone. Boy, you pulled the bitch. You pulled the bitch. Oh, now them just fucked up about your boy. Yo, yo, say what's up. Like, oh, they about to lose their mind. Go ahead, bitch. You jam this man. You jam these niggas every day before practice. Bitch, say what's up, nigga. That's crazy. Yo, dad. What's up, yo, nigga? He trying to act tough. I feel you. Nah, y'all, you with real yeah. niggas, yo. That's crazy, yeah. though. Next time you got to You know what, though? You know what, though? All respect, salute to this, man. Because, you know, I've been... Especially Kodak and YB, man. Like, they beef low-key. Like, it made me feel like... Like, I don't know. I feel like us as fans, because I feel like YB and Yak really the leaders of the new school for hip-hop, man. They really are. They came in around the same time. They got just as much of influence and just as much of wave and just motion. I hate that they had that little fallout, man. But you know what? I've always felt like on at least Kodak's side of things that he always wanted to kind of be cool with young boy again. He even said it in songs, you know, he wanted to just call him up and see what it, you know, what everything was about. I just felt like it always kind of depended on young boy. But now young boy is in like a new mindset right now. You know, he on some he on some grown man business for real. You know, making amends with a lot of people he was once into it with. You know, it's it's sometimes it's hard to, you know. Let the past be the past, though, but commend both of these kings for squashing it, though. Now, with this being said, bro, like, Yak and YB, they squashed it. Now, I'm, I'm not too sure about, like, you know, the legal side of things and they and they cases and they situation. I don't know if they can be around each other legally, but that don't mean that they can't drop music together. You know what I mean? That don't mean they can't drop music. And all I'm going to say is, man... Uh, hey, NBA Youngboy and Kodak song in 2023. Yes, sir. I'm all for it. I'm all for it, man. Two ghosts, though. So it sounded like it was like a fan that walked up to both of them at the end. Oh, that's major. Imagine walking up to Kodak. You see him on FaceTime with NBA Youngboy. That's big, though, man. That's big. 
you know, I'm glad I'm glad they squashed it. I'm glad they squashed it, man. I'm excited to see what they do for real. So who is Jake Jit? Yo, I've been seeing this video circulating like he was. Yeah, here you go right here. Say Fulio was in the interrogation room butchering a raw way song. Say mama, hey mama, I've been feeling homesick. The demons inside my heart and I've been feeling growing. I call people around me without even knowing. Bro. Y'all yeah, call different attendances that they wasn't showing. Sure. I ain't gonna lie, bro. People just stand you on your back. This how you know, bro, is from Florida. Who is this comfortable sitting in an interrogation room to just pop out and just sing a Rod Wave song? I'll be in there sweating bullets thinking about what I want to get off the menu. Now, let me stop. I ain't gonna. I ain't gonna, I ain't gonna tell, hold on. Smile in your face, people that act how they act, but they want your space. Say that is love out they mouth, but they really hate. Swab it, leg it for peace, they beg it for space. What song is this? Lord, I'm just digging to an end. Lord, I'm just a nigga, so I sing. We spin it, but we spin it, but then spin it again. He gotta think about what he did. I've been feeling pain so long. I don't remain no. I don't make it no better. I give my heart to whoever. They take it and they run. You had me, but you lost me. I'm not mad, I'm exhausted. Please, please. That's some real Florida boys, man. So I didn't see this. So they actually in there interrogating them. Yeah. You ever, you ever see Jake Jett or? Who? Jake Jett. Who the fuck is that? It's pretty <laughs> near this dude, Kish Yeah. Oh, no, Pat J. Who the fuck? You don't know who that is? Japan? How about that one? Yeah, nah. What the fuck? You don't know who that is? He's always hanging out with your brother. Nah, it, nah not like when I say my brother did. Like, that's my that's what I'm saying. So you don't keep track of the people that you're close with? But niggas grown, bro. I could be right here in Cali, niggas way. Bro. I ain't gonna lie, that's crazy that bro actually keeping it, he keeping it solid. He said, who is Jake Jit? He said, you heard of Jake Jit? Who is Jake Jit? I don't know no Jake Jit. What you talking about, partner? Yeah. You ever, you ever see Jake Jit or? Who? He said who? Jake Jit. Who the fuck is that? <laughs> <laughs> they thought that boy was about to get in there and sang. Now he sang before the interrogation. He wasn't singing to them people though, man. Hold on. Okay. Okay, Fulio. In a party, you cannot get in. <laughs> Busting out the zins. Pulling up the meat. Yeah. I can shake your hand. I'm not. No, I'm not your friend. Let me in that one night, man. 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 Shit weak. No. Oh. <laughs> These boys were something else, man. They were something else, though. But it's crazy, though. It's crazy, though, because Vaughn and Dirk, I think, you know, Dirk, for sure, you know, the biggest rapper. But I feel like it, as far as, like, the street side of things, Vaughn and Dirk was, like, the head honcho of each of their size, man. It's just crazy, man, that they both gone. But that was crazy. Like, why do you, why do, you do them like that, though, man? I said Reese's out. Boy, this is not Lil Reese. Ain't no way this, this the this the this the Grim. Ain't no way this is him. Ain't no way this Lil Reese. I ain't even know bro was locked up. I ain't know bro was locked up. They said he came out looking like out from the corner store. That's crazy. That's crazy. <laughs> That's crazy. Bro, what did he? What was he even locked up for? I didn't even know bro was locked up, man. And that's crazy, cause, damn, Jill did that to him. That's crazy.
Nah, it's about Chloe. Chloe said Chloe, bro. Nah, we went to Bonnie. I'm trying to take it to the back. Chloe, I just did. Nah, hold on, man. Cuz just got stabbed. Nah, yeah, nigga just stabbed me and shit. Nigga really stepped on shit. Nigga just stabbed me and shit. Like, 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 nah, for real. They be, they be, man. They be really on that time, man. Something just happened. First place, they, they ain't going to the hospital. They not going to get checked out. Bleeding out. They going to the stool. They going to the stool. Nigga just stabbed me and shit. Running it, running it, it, like, like, come on, man. That's crazy. That's crazy. That's funny as hell. God, That's God, crazy. God. Yeah, nigga just shot me and shit. Oh. Nigga really stepped on shit. Oh, he got a new puppy, so, so we gonna stop with that shit. Oh, he got a new puppy, <laughs> so we gonna stop with that shit. Bro, these niggas funny as hell. Post that shit, post that shit. Say, man, I can't wait till young boy get back on the road to do shows. Yeah, young boy gonna get back on the road to do shows. Yeah, young boy gonna get back on the road to do shows. Yeah, young boy gonna young boy get back on the road to do shows. You know crazy? I ain't getting the copyright, but you know what's crazy though? This, like, he was a big star when he last did shows, but I feel like, bro, really entering just a new realm right now. Like this, imagine this, but I'm I'm talking like bro probably gonna be selling out like football stadiums, bro. Like this, this is gonna be probably half of the audience, bro. Like, I'm telling you, like, as much as I want to go to a young boy show, I feel like people going to go crazy over this, man. I think people are going to go absolutely crazy over, over NBA young boy. Like, imagine this times like five to this times 10. People going to be trampling over each other, trying to run up front. People, a lot of people going to get hurt. Like, nah. Like I I watch the highlights, man. Y'all y'all got it. But when he do go back on tour though, it's for sure it's gonna sell out very, very fast. Very, very fast. Fulio say he doesn't think Queso killed Bibby. And that man fighting the whole case right now. I don't with that on nobody. My reaction though, know, I kinda knew Queso was gonna get charged with it, because like when you putting stuff on social not saying he did it or it. Not saying he did it, but you got to think about how Jacksonville is set up. Just like Kenny K case, they they charged La Robert with murder, knowing he ain't do that. Just all word of mouth, just people tweeting, just like stuff. Social media, you would get charged off social media. You know what I'm saying? I feel like they charged Queso off social media. You get what I'm saying? I don't feel like he did it. I feel like he did it. You know, I ain't, I ain't, I ain't going to speak on that. I ain't going to... If you know, you know, but I ain't, I ain't got to speak on that. <laughs> Bro was about to just walk right past him. TF2? <laughs> Carol said, God damn, all you niggas got on TF chains. Even Zay? Even Zay? That's crazy. You on TF2? Bro, I don't know why that's so funny to me, bro. Why is that shit so funny to me? Man, free chef G, man. Boy, dappered out up in there, though. Hold on. Boy, dappered out, man. Hold on. Better not be no female CEOs, boy. Boy. He got clean. Is this a rolly? Is this a rolly? Are these pictures? These can't be pictures from inside, man. How do you get this? How do you get a, a whole suit? That's crazy. What he? They said the pastor. He low key might be the church pastor in there. Hold on, Father Chef. Blue my boo, baby. Said Didi Osama. Hey guys, this is my first day of babysitting. Didi, are you hungry? What? I'm dark fool. No, no, no. Put it down. Now. Boy, what? What was that? Okay. All right, moving on. Said so young boy, Yak is back. It's only right these two locked back in. No, for sure. For sure. You know, honestly, bro, I'm I'm gonna be real with y'all, man. You know, um, I get it. 
you know, between YB and Dirk. I get it. But, like, I feel like, I mean, Kodak, Kodak and YB's issue was some way before that, you know, way before the situation happened. But Young Boy and Lil Baby, I feel like Young Boy really kind of going through and, and, and really starting to lock back in with people that he really don't have an issue with that he probably cut off just due to their association with other people. But I feel like now, you know, he kind of is starting to come around to him, man. I would love to see YB and Lil Baby back on good terms, man. I think the last song they made together was that one shot. It was for, uh, was it the Fast and Furious movie? But that could have been like some label some label business that they had to do, some liabilities for the label. But I would love to see YB and uh, Lil Baby back on good terms. You know, I know, you know, only reason YB dissed Baby was, you know, because of the voice of the heroes, you know, and Baby linking up with Dirk. But um, like I said, you know, the YB and Dirk beef, probability of that being you know being let go is very very low but as far as yb and, and, and little baby that would be that'll be cap i said that'd be cap that'll be that'll be fire i read no cap name and i said cap but that'll be that'll be tough though man now that's why i'm saying like this ain't even no beef like he yeah he sent some slick you know some slick shots at at little baby and that um you know an ia young boy but you know they can move past that it ain't no nobody's dropped behind this ain't no little baby i don't even think little baby ever responded to nba young boy so i feel like they could low key low key that'll be fire though hold on everybody been sending me this so this is queso's dad snitching on his son snitching on queso Everybody been sending me this. I've never seen this. Now, when you watched that video of the murder of Charles McCormick, did you recognize the shooter? Yes, sir. Who was the shooter in that video? Hakeem Robinson. Your son, Hakeem Robinson. Yes, sir. Right. Um, and obviously, he's your son, so you're very familiar with him. Yes, sir. Now, I know we all got our gonna snitch, gonna didn't snitch. You know, we all feel a little different on that. Boy, this is straight up telling. He called him by his government name. The name he gave him at birth when he first held him in his arms. That's exactly how he pronounced his name. That's crazy. That's crazy, Pops. That's crazy. Now, when you watched that video of the murder of Charles McCormick, did you recognize the shooter? Yes, sir. Who was the shooter in that video? Hakeem Robinson. Your son, Hakeem Robinson. Yes, sir. That's crazy, man. You know, I, I I don't be surprised when it be your own partners turning against you. But yo, dad, though, it said Fulio finna have a blast with this video. Yeah, I'm surprised Fulio ain't already drop a uh, ain't already dropped a, a a video about it, man. That's crazy. That's crazy. All right, man. So after going through trying to find something else, man, I could not find anything else, man. But I feel like. You know, I want to do more videos like this. Like I said, I always want to expand the content on the channel. Y'all seem to really be rocking with the um, Predicting Hip Hop in 2023 video that I put up. Um, I got another video similar to that that I'm working on. Should be dropping next week as well as a number, a series of other videos, man. I got my notebook somewhere. I've been, man, I'm telling y'all, I've been clocking in work. I'm trying to expand content here on the channel. Of course, we'll stu still do music reactions. We might even branch out and do reactions to just like other stuff too, man. So... Yeah, appreciate all y'all though, man. If you are new to the channel, hit that subscribe button for me. And until the next video, I'll see y'all then. Thank you for watching Maniachi TV. I'm out.